Hey everybody, I wanted to fire off this video real quick because I have just gotten a ton of questions over the past few days about Retta True Tide. It's so dang popular, everybody's on it. People are either on it for weight loss, there's people taking it for performance enhancement as well too. There's a lot of anecdotal reports about people are just performing better kind of in all aspects of the gym. And personally, I think that's because of the insulin response that Rutta will create and insulin itself is anabolic as we know, but that's for a different story. So these questions have been all about dosing. What I'm gonna do here is I'm just gonna pull up this overlay and I'm gonna leave it up here for a little while. This is from an Instagram post that I did, I think back in April. So this came straight out of a journal of, of a phase two trial that was done in 2023. And as you can see, it is dosed very similarly to how Ozempic or Munjaro is. You take it once a week. And again, this is for, for weight loss here. You could start as low as one to two milligrams per week, titrate up as needed. The highest tested dose that I know of is 12 milligrams a week, and, and that is a lot. Uh, it is a very strong, powerful peptide, powerful. But again, it's it's very, very simple here. You start low and you progress as needed. Now, as always, please, please, please be sure to talk to your physician, your healthcare provider for doing this because this is a very powerful peptide here and you need to make sure that you are appropriate to take this, that there's no contraindications, but that's how it's done for weight loss. Now, microdosing. Microdosing is a, is a completely different story here. And it is the Wild West. There's a lot of people doing it a lot of different ways, but one of the most simple ways that people will microdose this is they'll take that weekly dose. So let's just say two milligrams in this example, you take that dose and you divide it by seven. So I went to public school here, that's about 0.3 milligrams per day, roughly. So instead of taking two milligrams once per week, people will microdose and they'll take 0.3 milligrams, roughly 0.3 milligrams, seven days a week and split it up that way. Now, again, as I mentioned, it is the wild west. Some people will start out with less than that. Some people will start out with more than that. Some people will take it every other day. Instead of taking it every other day, there's a lot of different ways to do it, but that is just one of the most simple common examples. So again, I wanted to fire out this video just in hopes that I could be able to send out a quick link for when I get these questions, but I am happy to answer any other questions that you may have, just to shoot me a DM or uh, reply to the emails that I sent out through my gum road. Otherwise, we'll talk soon.